Hello, this is for my grandkids, and it's Grandpa's story. There's a buzz in the air. There's a buzz in the air. It's a bee over there. It's just above Aunt Helen's big fluffy hair. It's flying around Chuck in the old wooden chair. It landed on April, and she fainted right there. Then he buzzed past the swing set and over the fence. Just a circle again. Oh, it doesn't make sense. He's spoiling our picnic and scaring the baby. He whizzed past the table right over the gravy. Round the tree, here he comes with more speed than a car. Close your mouth, squint your eyes, for he's not very far. Zoom! He goes faster than I can keep up this riddle. Look, he split Johnny's part in his hair down the middle. There's a buzz in the air, and he's flying by Pa, who's cutting grass with the lawnmower chewing up sod. Run in the house or hide under a rock. I think the buzz has just summoned his flock. He's after the watermelon or something more. Grab the chips, the cupcakes, and head for the door. Susie just screamed and plopped down in her chair. <laughs> Mother was tempted to leave her right there. Grandma's dress turned all red from the drink that Sam spilled. And she jumped and tipped over the jello well chilled. Then it bounced off Anne's face. On her nose left some cream. Then proceeded to splat on her lap. How oh, supreme! There's a buzz in the air. He just flew round the corner. We thought that we were all through with the horror, but no sooner could Anne clean off her pants than I looked up to see one giant army of ants.